Well, actually, I've uh, I've sprayed a little. I have a little fertilizer program that I do use the BioAg formula on too. And uh, you know, Wayne wanted me to do a little trial, which one year I did do a little trial, uh, and it worked tremendously. But the trial is no longer there because I do it on every piece, every piece of land I do. So I don't have nothing to to compare it to because I know it works. I've seen it, you know. When I was young, and Daddy would plow. You would smell the rich, earthy smell. It's coming back now. And I just needed some help. And we worked an agreement out to put the microorganisms down and the ag formula uh, fertilizer. And I was convinced that uh, as much trouble as I was having, I'd, I'd do anything to get things in order and uh, the last two years I hadn't lost a cow uh, the cattle look much better uh, the soil seems to be better and the uh, guy that does my baling he said he'd never seen it that tall before so something seems to be working anyway Welcome to the American Rancher. I'm Pam Minnick. On today's show, we introduce you to BioSI Technology, an organization that is helping change the environment by reducing the toxicity that we live in every day. Microbial products are not experimental. They've been used effectively in the U.S. for more than 20 years. The future of these products is expanding as more is learned about the jobs they perform for plants and animals. BioSI Technology has been working to discover how microbes improve soil, help plants produce better, and provide healthier plants and animals. I spent about 20 years working in the medical field uh, in the Med Center in Houston. One of the things that we got to noticing is a lot of farmers would come in, particularly to MD Anderson, and they had all types of cancers and stuff like that. We realized is if we could help the farming community reduce the toxic chemicals that they use, we might be able to alleviate some of the problems that they were having with cancer. There was a lot of work done with microbes in, in Europe in the 60s and early 70s. And one of the things I got to thinking about was, well, what if we use soil inoculants to improve our soil, possibly improve the quality of our food sources, and also rebuild the soil at the same time that we're doing growing crops, making all the changes that we were going to. And in doing so, one of the things that we realize is that microbes do a lot of the work in all aspects of, of life, not only for the soil, but for animals, because when animals eat grass, they pull up part of the, the plant roots and get the dirt into their mouth, and there it contains the microbes. If the soil is depleted in microbes, that means a lot of animals are not going to be getting the beneficial microbial populations that they used to get 50, 60 years ago from the soil. And so that was one of the primary reasons that we started the inoculants to rebuild the soil, the soil life, and also to improve the carbon fraction or the humus fraction of the soil to hold on to water and nutrients. We started out with our ag formula primarily because that was where most of the work had been done. And then we got to looking at specialty products, products that not only contained microbes, but also soil fungi that helps improve uh, the root zone, helps go outside the rhizosphere to bring back food and water to the plants. And then we looked at other products to help break down plant stubble. You've spent money to put nutrients into the ground to grow the crop. You can use SD25 to reuse all of the elements that that plant used to grow. In other words, your fertilizers, your nitrogen, phosphate, your potassium, and all the trace elements can be reutilized if you can re break that down to where it can be reused by the next crop. And so it saves the farmer money and it also adds humus to the soil. As we hear farmers across the United States talk about, water is becoming critical in, in everywhere. 
we either have too much or too little. Where the humus helps is when we have too little. That means that it can hold on to any heavy dews that we get, small rains or whatever, and that way it doesn't just run off to the ditch and carry away your nutrients that you just put out and things like that. So it's very beneficial to the soil and to the plants. The strength of our product is the diversity of the microbes that are in the product. Um, and we think that that helps out with, helping, uh, with nutrient cycling in the soil. It also gives it some, uh, a little bit of a buffer when it gets in the soil uh, to where you know, some of the species that might not survive in certain uh, situations, uh, there would be sort of a, something to take its place. Uh, some of the compounds that are made by certain microorganisms uh, help out with the growth of other microorganisms, and this is something that's well documented. Uh, so we think that you know having a diverse blend of microbes not only has the benefit of getting a diverse uh, blend to keep things in check in the soil, but also to stimulate some of the native microbes that are beneficial in the soil. All of the BioSI products are liquid, so they're very easy to use. You can use them either by themselves in a spray tank, use ground applicator. Uh, you can mix them with fertilizer. You can put it through your irrigation system. If you have subsurface irrigation, you can use it that way also just by dripping it into the deal. We even have people in California that, that dribble it into their flood water as they're watering that way. So it's easy to use. Some people look at uh, microbial products sort of like how they look at fertilizer products in that uh, they're looking for overnight results. Um, and that doesn't quite work for microbial products. It has to be more of a program that is maintained over time to help build carbon in the, in the soil, to help build numbers and diversity of microbes in the soil. Uh, and it's only really with, with time and uh, continuing a program that you see the best benefits. We not only test our products ourselves, we send our products to a food lab, which is much stricter than a microbiology lab. And the reason we do that is we want to make sure that our products don't have salmonella, listeria, campylobacteria, uh, or any of the bad things that, that can cause problems for our customers or their animals. There's a lot of companies that are coming out with microbial products. One of the things I like to point out to people is that BioSI technology has been around. We we actually incorporated it in 2006, but we, I started working with microbes in 1989. And uh, so we didn't just start in the business. We actually grow our microbes. We, we actually make the products and we don't uh, just buy them from someone, put them in a jug and sell them to the farmers. We've done a lot of research, spent many years developing what we're doing. And with our plans for the future is to build uh, a plant where we can actually have acreage to demonstrate to farmers what microbes can do in not only growing crops but in rebuilding the soil at the same time. And I think that's going to be the key thing to the future of agriculture. If we continue to farm the way we are, uh, over tilling our soil, not growing cover crops, things like that, keeping our soils bare and not taking care of the microbial community, our agriculture programs are going to be in trouble in the not too distant future. Jackpot Livestock Probiotic is an easy to use liquid in feed or water that increases feed efficiency and promotes animal health. Jackpot is ideal in all feeding programs and certified in value added programs. It reduces days on feed by increasing average daily gain. It reduces days off feed from hauling stress and more. It's proven high risk cattle are better managed with Jackpot. Whether you have five head or 5,000, protect your investment for cents a day with Jackpot. Made in America and veteran owned. Thinking of selling your working ranch horse? Would you like to show your horse to potential buyers all across the nation? The leader in livestock marketing is doing it again with a superior spring horse auction on Saturday, June 4th. This is an excellent opportunity to showcase your consignment broadcast live on Rural TV. Did you know Rural TV can reach over 14 million households? There's a buyer out there for you. Call to consign today, space is limited. 800-422-2117.
Welcome back to the American Rancher. Past tillage practices and the overuse of pesticides and fertilizers has compromised the ability of the indigenous population of microbes to keep the soil open and friable as it was 80 to 100 years ago. That's why our soils are in the condition they're in today, hard, crusty, and depleted of nutrients. Microbes used in BioSI products come from the soil. They've developed methods to grow them, which help them become a part of the soil workforce. When used over time, they also help stimulate the indigenous microbes to work again. One of the things we realized early on is our programs for fertilization weren't working as well as they, they should. And as we become more familiar with what microbes do and, and how they work in the soil, we realize that they actually make the fertilizers more available to the, to the crop. So the more diversity that you have in the soil, the higher the microbial population, the better the fertilization program works. So it essentially, all the products from BioSI help your fertilization programs be more efficient. And that's important because it can save you money as the, the microbes die. They also put proteins in the soil, which become a nitrogen source for the plants and also breaking down the plant debris to humus to hold on to the water and nutrients in the rhizosphere. So they make everything that you do on your land more efficient. And we started with uh, BioSI. I think we used uh, what ag formula is what we used. And uh, that turned out to be very successful. I mean, it really just really worked really well in, in where we just did a test plot. And from there we expanded, and on half their acreage we did the program. And, uh, and since that time we've used uh, the, the products on all of their, all their farmland. Uh, from that time on, two years later we were doing everything. And uh, we, we feel that for each year, considering the moisture, considering the weather conditions, we were done as well as we can do pretty well with what we brought up for our inputs. Using these products, we found that we can increase our production, but we also are able to manage our farming operations better. We do not have to, we, we, we're not no-tilling, but we're down to minimum till. I call it minimum till. We started doing a lot of strip tilling that we really couldn't do in a good way in the past, but with, with these products, uh, our land is changing, our condition, our soils are changing. Uh, it makes it much easier to get prepared to plant and there's no really good substitute for a good seed bed and it sure improves our seed beds. Well, I have X amount that I budget for fertility every year. I backed out on my fertilizer and replaced it with the BioSI products. Uh, and I do not think, uh, and for the same amount of money, I think it's increased yields. The texture of the land changes. You dig in it and work it with your hands and all, and feeling it's it's improved, it's changed, it makes it much easier to farm. The part that really impresses me the most is the the earthworm activities that I'm seeing now. Back to nature, I, easier on the ground. I I don't know what you call it, but I like what I see. We started using uh, BioSI three years ago. We were uh, following some high moisture corn where we uh, were trying to get into potatoes for the next year and we were, knew we were gonna have some problems with the residue. So we treated our, our corn stalks on some high moisture corn three years ago with SD25. Um, and through that product, it, it, it dissolved pretty well ate up all the stalks over the winter and we were able to get in and put the potatoes in in the next spring with no no issues at all. And from there we began using the products uh, every year. We pretty well put it on every acre between the, the Select and the Ag Formula and the SD25 depending on what use we're using it for. You know we've used numerous biologicals in the past and really didn't see much out of them and this the BioSI lineup works and works actually above expectations and it just it it's actually made a difference in the soil you know it's one of the few products that we've used that is actually you can see a difference we started the program 
with uh, uh, a farmer, the La Rosa Cattle Company, about six, seven years ago. And they tried like a 40 acre strip. And uh, the, the farmer that was actually custom combining it for him called the entomologist and was asking him, you know, what did you do? What's different? What they did was they put out the BioS Ag formula. The yield increased anywhere from 1,000 to 1,500 pounds during that year. And since that year, we've had two or three extras get on board. BioSI ag product can be used on any type of farming operation there is. You have sustainable ag programs, you have uh, conventional ag programs and organic. We can be used on any one. Uh, all of our products are certified organic for the agriculture market. However, that doesn't mean that they have to be used on organic programs at only. So our three-step program is uh, our select, which are, is our seed inoculant. Um, that should be done at the time of planting. Step two is our agricultural formula. It's used during the growing season to uh, keep up the numbers of bacteria, the diversity, uh, and to help with nutrient cycling and help, help out compete pathogens uh, that might get into the system. And our third step is the SD25 field stubble digester uh, that helps break down any debris that's left over post-harvest and get those nutrients that you've already paid for back into the soil. The ag formula helps reduce crusting. That allows water to penetrate into the soil. The ag select helps improve the root zone, which lets the plant take up more of the water and also the nutrients. And the SD25 breaks down all the, the dead roots, the plant debris, and all of that. So it helps hang on to all the nutrients and water that would normally just run off to the ditch. When we come back, we'll learn about jackpot, livestock probiotics bringing beneficial soil-borne microbes found in nature to your animals. You're watching The American Rancher. Stay with us. Get the most out of your nutritional program with BioSI Technologies Jackpot, an easy-to-use, direct-fed microbial. Every successful value-added program is using. The Jackpot has got them on feed quicker. We've had lower death loss, lower medicine use, and better gains. Jackpot is certified by the WSDA for organic use and is on the IMI Global Feed Verified list. Don't gamble with your nutritional plans. High-risk cattle are better managed with Jackpot. You got worms? Ever heard of Cydectin Injectable? Good, because Cydectin Injectable is the fastest working dewormer on the market today. And the faster you stop raising worms instead of cattle, the faster cattle are gonna grow, right? What's even better, Cydectin Injectable has only a 21 day withdrawal period. You know what that means, don't you? You don't have to wait as long to send a calf to market. <coughs> Talk to your veterinarian about treating your cattle with Cydectin Injectable. Welcome back to the American Rancher. For many livestock producers, it's a simple equation, using the right amount of feed for desired daily gains. But how do you ensure your animals are effectively and efficiently using the feed for best results? Jackpot Livestock Probiotics promote a healthy digestive system by improving assimilation of nutrients from the feed animals receive. In fact, by using Jackpot, animals look better and are healthier. If the soil is already depleted in microbes, uh, the diversity has been uh, diminished either by tillage, chemicals, what have you, the animals that live out in the pasture that eat the grass, pull the grass roots up into their mouth and so forth, are not getting the microbes that they used to be able to get from the soil, so their digestive process may not be as effective as it used to be. One of the things that we've thought about was, well, not only do farmers in a lot of cases not want to use a microbial product because they really don't understand what they do and the benefits of them. Well, what can we do to help the animal get the microbes that they need to keep their gut healthy? And so we decided that we would start working on building a products, a group of products that would help animals digest their food better, keep them healthier, and uh, reduce the, the amount of antibiotics and other chemicals that you have to give them to keep them healthy. So the premise of using a direct fed microbial uh, is first to help outcompete any kind of pathogens that might get in. 
Uh, so that means that a product will take up space uh, and help out with uh, keeping an animal healthy. Continuing to do studies uh, to look at how jackpot can help with things like average daily gain, morbidity, mortality, um, and the overall health of, of animals. Um, and we're seeing good results. They just seem to be doing better. The cattle look healthier. Uh, I'd rather do something preventative than to try to fix something after they get sick. My barn cats, they, they water out of there, they look healthier. I mean, I know that sounds crazy, but uh, everything that's drinking that water uh, seems to be healthier. And the neighbors come by and they see how the, they see my cattle out in the pasture and at the coffee shop, they'll say, boy, I saw them cows and they sure do look good. And, and some of those cows are, are older but they still look fleshy and just seem to be in better health. Jackpot is not a species-specific direct-fed microbial, meaning that it does not contain ruminal uh, microflora. Uh, it's soil-borne organisms, so it can fit seamlessly into uh, beef programs just as well as it can turkey, poultry, sheep and goats. It can be utilized in any meat animal industry program. Back in 2011, I started my deer farm, and uh, my first fawn crop, uh, we had 1.8 fawns um, per mama doe, and our survival rate was only 0.7. I was talking with Wayne, and he had that product jackpot, and he introduced it to me. And uh, since I started using that, this past year, 2015 fawns, uh, my fawn crop was 1.95, survival rate was 1.9. Uh, I have buddies that I've tried to get on jackpot that are deer farmers. They're not on it. Their survival rate was like one compared to their fawn crop of like one eight. And they, my, do, my fawn does and bucks are twice as big as their fawn does and bucks at like three months. The effectiveness of jackpot and the, and the benefits from uh, some of the producers that we, we work with um, are going to be an increase in average daily gain on the performance side. Um, they notice that, uh, that animals are uh, come in their receiving program uh, wanting to eat and drink uh, quicker. Um, they can reduce the amount of their antibiotics or their doctoring or they can, they can reduce the amount of medicines that they're using in their program because animals are naturally healthier and the morbidity and mortality of their animal population is reduced. We have a, about a 6,000 head feed lot that we uh, typically have grower and stalker calves in and uh, we started using jackpot uh, during this winter. We were having some illness and so we've started, started pre-treating some cattle um, using the product and then we also run uh, approximately 800 head of mother cows and we've started using uh, jackpot on our, our baby calves uh, as day olds. We give them a treatment for that with their beginning uh, shots. The illness in, the, in our day old calves has seemed like it's gone down. Um, it only takes a couple calves not getting sick to pay for itself real fast and so that's what I would say is just because of the price point on it, it's, it's a very economical decision. When we sell a, a, a farmer our products, we want to become part of the team. We're not going to tell you what to do, but we'll certainly make suggestions on how we can make things that you're doing more efficient. Our products will help make the fertilizer program that they're currently using more efficient. And in many instances, we find that we can reduce the amount of inputs that they're having, reduce the disease so that they're using less pesticides, less fungicides, and so we work with them as a program rather than just selling you a product and hoping that everything goes well. So it's, it's been a learning process for me and um, like I said, I, I, I learn a little bit every year but I'm convinced that I'm going to stick with this program because up to now it seems to have worked pretty, pretty well. There is no question that the microbial products developed by BioSI Technology help to improve the overall environment by utilizing natural resources to improve crop and animal production. 
To learn more about the products provided by BioSI or learn more about their programs, go to their website, biositechnology.com. You'll be glad you did. To learn more about us, go to our website, theamericanrancher.com, or find us on Facebook. For the entire American Rancher team, thanks for joining us. We'll see you right back here next week.